So does barometric pressure truly matter when it comes to fishing? So when I started fishing, um, especially fishing a lot of tournaments and things like that, I started to look into ways to catch more fish. And one of the answers that came up that I wasn't sure that if it was true or if it really mattered was barometric pressure. Um, so for those of you that are familiar with it, basically what they say is when the pressure's high, you know, the fish are slow and they don't bite. When the pressure's low, the fish will be more active. So today, I have a really good day to just go out and test that theory on the water. You know, according to this chart that I have in front of me, it says high is 30.5 and up, and it says fish will be slower and moderately active. Pressure medium, 29.7, to 30.4 good normal fishing conditions. And then low it says 29.6 and down, fish will be less active and bite slowly. So if the pressure's too high, they're gonna be slow. If the pressure's too low, they're going to be slow. Now what does this mean when it comes to weather? The rising temperature when it rises means the weather's going to improve, right? And it says the fish are gonna be slow and slightly active. Stable weather, which is fair, means good, normal fishing conditions. Falling means degrading weather, which means best fishing conditions. So now, today, the day that I have in front of me, according to the app that I've downloaded on Google Play, it says the barometric pressure 43 minutes ago was 29.85. I also have a chart that has a history of what the temperature has recently been. In the past 72 hours, a couple days ago, the barometric pressure was 30.25, and then it has drastically dropped, and then it dropped to 30.1 a day ago, has went up, dropped down back down to like 29.9, went back up to 30, and then we are here at today, which we're looking at 29.8 and below. So it has gone up a little bit between 29.8 and 29.9, but according to this history, it looks like the barometric pressure is gonna drop even more. Um, now what the day looks like, we have a cloudy day. It looks like it's been raining this morning just a little bit. And the, the weather, you know, what's good is it's December. So I really wanna test this in, in, in a month where the fishing can be a little bit slower. So it lo looks like the weather is, 66 66 degrees 68 degrees um and it's going to go up to 72 degrees 73 75 by one o'clock zero percent chance of rain and it looks like the wind is coming out of the southwest uh around 13 15 miles an hour so and i do know that tomorrow um it's supposed to be really super windy and we're gonna hit the 80s so I'm gonna take you guys out to Ray Roberts Lake and see if we can put this theory to test just to hopefully answer some questions because I had a lot of questions when it came to it too. So why not, let's take a look at these numbers and see if we can get on any fish. See you on the water.
fish. Oh, it's wide. Beautiful. Coming out to this windblown point, and it's windy, obviously. And he came off of uh, exactly where I thought he would. Man. It is literally 112. So I caught that, uh, caught that small one earlier, and I caught that catfish dude, and that was like 11.30. Now I, I lost one, but I decided to get off that riprap and then try something different. And then that one came off that point, so good fish. Let's see if we can get another one. Good sign right there. Ah. This one's not a keeper, not as big as the other one, but. Not a keeper, but nice one. Alright guys, that's the end to my day. 
about three o'clock it's time to go home overall not a bad day we caught about five fish um one decent one we lost a good one and then we lost a couple small ones also caught a catfish um any day you catch fish is a good day any day on the water is a good day as far as the barometric pressure is concerned it is still sitting about 29.76 so i will let you guys be the judge on that um overall good day of fishing let me get you one more fish show it to you and then we'll get the release done Beautiful fish, nice, wide, so let's get the release guys. Mm. There she goes. All right y'all, do me a favor, hit that button, subscribe, like the videos. Um, hopefully I can get you guys better footage in the future. Thanks for time. Thanks for watching and uh, thanks for taking time out of your day. Appreciate it It's like a family tree